There was a movie, Long Kiss Goodnight, which was created in 1996. It is a scene where it was being planned to bomb WTC and then put the blame on Muslims. That scene is in the attached video. We are passing through a time of great tribulations where we cannot clearly differentiate between right and wrong. That's why it is called a time of fitna or a tribulation. I will reply the other letter of yours so do not respond to this letter. Somehow I wrote the letter and pressed a wrong button which took me to another page and the letter was lost. I have to rewrite the reply. Your letter. Yeah I get irritated when people lie to me. You've lied repeatedly and you're still doing it. Then read my last letter to you again. I explained each time you lied to me. These were not innocent errors on your part. You knew better. You were too unspecific about what you consider to be a lie on my part. Your last letter is long too and I do not understand what you consider a lie. However to deny existence of God is one's lying to himself. That too is a lie. As is asserting as fact that which is not evidently true. To understand God look at this universe and our human body, our social needs and our longings to stay connected with God. Then we must study those scriptures that call themselves as words of God, and try to understand the connection between them all. Every scripture calls to worship one God, and then it also invites to respect the person who brought that scripture. So there is no place of my God and your God. We are talking about God the one who created us both. That's why you can give me your blood if it can be cross-matched without your religion or atheism. This is because we humans are creation of one God. So do not say, my God, and, your God. And you have accepted that it is not disproven by science that God created us. Why not give consideration to the story from God's part? Will you read only first three chapters of Quran? Visit this link to read first three chapters of the Quran. English